The truth is most life coaches don't make money. In today's session, if you're a life coach, I'm gonna show you how to make money as a life coach. My name is Ed J.C. Smith. I got a second chance at life and I'm here to help you live life on your terms. Today's session, we're gonna cover how to become a life coach and actually make money as a life coach. Now, the truth is, as I said, most life coaches do not make money in today's market. Go do the research, go find them online, um, go check out the coaching consultancy groups and you'll find most life coaches don't make very much money. Uh, I'm not saying you know some don't because there, there'll be a small fraction in any niche in any area. Now here's what you're gonna do, all right? If you're a life coach, don't hate down on me straight away in the comments, all right? Here's, First of all, I love life coaching. Everything is life coaching. All right, any sort of kite coaching, kite coaching, any sort of coaching is going to be life coaching, right? Because you're going to be helping someone in health, wealth, or relationships, whatever that may be, right? That's an area of life, isn't it? The problem, pay attention, is you need to nail down on the problem rather than talking about the tools. All right, so most people have had done some sort of training, NLP, CBT, cognitive change, timeline therapy, Reiki, tapping, roofling, um, you name it, all right? Any certification, I've done it too. Hey, I've spent a hundred grand plus on my certifications. I've done tapping, NLP, CBT, traditional psychology, behavioral change, rapid change, life coaching, emotional management, leadership, um, EQ training, you name it, all right, I've taken it. I, I love training and I love, you know, courses, I love learning. But the problem is, if you start talking about your training, like it, it, when you market yourself as an NLP practitioner, no one cares about that anymore because a load of people have already marketed in that way. That's not how people think about services. They think, I have a problem, I need someone to help me with the problem, right? That's how people think. They don't think, I have a problem, I need someone that is, you know, hypnotherapy trained or NLP trained or that's not how they think. They think about the problem first, then they'll do some research on your background. I'm, so I'm not saying your certifications have got no value. Of course they've got great value. They give you the skill set, they give you the tools, the methods and all of that sort of stuff. And then you develop your own method off the back of that. I've got a full certification program where I train people how to be a coach and the skills of a coach, what I learned through a hundred thousand plus of certifications that at times some were very waffly and in, today we live in a very different world. Today we live in you know Zoom culture and so a lot of these transformation techniques don't work like they used to because you're not seeing someone face to face. So I developed a very unique style, it's called the expert coach journey and it's a rapid transformational technique process that you can really quickly simply diagnose someone's problem, assess and break the beliefs that are holding that person back underneath it, then retrain that belief and then compound for results in, in, their, you know, in any area of their life. It works in health, wealth, or relationship. That's a four-step process for rapid change. And so this is not about that, you know, just, just a heads up. This is about, you know, how do you make money as a life coach? Well, first of all, you need to stop calling yourself a life coach, all right, and, and market yourself around a problem. That's, that, in essence, is what I want you to get from this training today, okay? So, you know, I, I've had loads of clients come to me as a life coach, going out on Instagram, doing loads of free content and not getting any clients. Doing it over and over again, year after year and not getting any clients. Someone like Kevin came to me as a life coach, or I wanted to be a life coach, done some personal training, had never actually coached anyone. And so because it just wasn't working online, putting out loads of free content around habits and all of that sort of thing, you know, I, I'm not saying people don't consume that sort of stuff, but are they gonna actually become a client off the back of it? No. So we actually put him into the anxiety um, space where he's now a anxiety, you know, anxiety coach. He helps people get rid of anxiety. So if you have anxiety and you want to get rid of it, then you work with him. Does it? And then how he teaches his methodology, how he gives him the results is a combination of the, you know, the qualifications he's taken, the meth methodology that he's developed off the back of that. And, you know, so that's how he gets someone a result. Someone, um, you, you know, like uh, Najoni came to me. She was a life coach, all of that sort of stuff. And, you know, as we started to unpick her story, we we're able to realize that actually, you know, she's better off, you know, in the grief space, 
All right, so she's gone through some amazing, uh, she's gone through some amazingly um, uh, traumatic experiences that allowed her to level up and, and allowed her to go on this new um, journey where she wanted to get rid of these sorts of problems. She had had, you know, she had five of her family members die and she, she found a way through that process, which is of course a horrendous situation to happen to anyone. And so now she helps other people get over the life, uh, developing a life after loss. So her program is called Life After Loss. So she's a grief coach, a grief specialist. Now, what's really important about this is that, say, for example, someone comes to uh, like Najoni for a specific problem, as in to get to get over the the grief, you know, to to, to allow life to continue on. All right, it's much easier for her to have a referral. And once she has two or three clients in that specific niche, you know, and then she's looking for the fourth client, it's much easier because they have the same problem and now they don't have that problem. And they, they relate to her clients because they had the same problem. And so if you're a generic life coach and then all of your clients are coming to you for a range of different problems, it just, you know, like you, you don't want to go to someone if they, you know, they help, they've helped someone lose weight, but you want to go to someone because you specifically want to get over the trauma of your past you know, relationship. Those are two different outcomes and you can't relate to those. You know, unless you have the same problem, you can't relate. And so it's very important, you know, pay attention. If you're a life coach right now and you're watching it, that you must structure your service around a problem. I promise you, all right? When you structure your service around a problem, you will make a massive difference. You will actually get clients that want to work with you. The whole thing works more effectively. The whole thing is more scalable. When you want to scale online and you have a load of clients with the same sorts of testimonials over and over again, it just stands you out from everyone else. And so that's why the majority of life coaches don't have any clients. They tend to be that person that's still in a job and they're just doing it a little bit on the part, a little bit of side hustle sort of thing. Nothing wrong with that. But the reason that they haven't jumped into it fully is because it doesn't work. Just a heads up, if it doesn't work, all right, it's never going to work. It's never going to work. If it doesn't work and you don't have a clear plan of how to make it work, it's never going to work. And so you either have a choice of get a clear plan, all right, of how it's going to work or give up and stay in your job. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. Having a job is, is, is awesome. All right. I have no issues with that. I'm not that person to slate down. You know, being an entrepreneur, having your own business, having your own consultancy based business in today's market is definitely not for everyone. It's only for a very specific sort of person. It's going to take time. It's going to take, you know, work to put in. And I, I recommend I recommend it's the best thing that you ever do. In today's market, I have to be careful about saying it's easy because everyone is oversensitive and a little bit um, kind of allergic to hard work. Um, I don't think it's hard work. Uh, you know, the, the paradox of that, I also don't think it's hard work. I mean, look at my hands, they've got like, you know, they're really soft. It's not hard work. You know, building an online coaching consultancy business is not what I'd classify as hard work. Again, if you really love what you do and if you're really ready to live and breathe it for the rest of your life, then go for it. If that being said, then definitely book a call with our team and so that they can actually get you one of my one-to-one -one sessions uh, with one of our team and they'll work out exactly the plan bespoke to you. But that's how you make money as a life coach, right? That's exactly how you do it. All right, you're really clear on the problem that you solve so that you can run an ad to that. If you, if you can't run an ad to a specific problem, then people can't relate to what you're talking about online. It's too generic, it comes across too waffly, and fundamentally, they just can't pigeonhole you. You have to pigeonhole initially your service so that you're banging on about the same problem over and over again, and so people can you know, resonate with that as well. So just a heads up, if you want a really clear plan of exactly how to grow your coaching consultancy business without the hassle, so you can get paid clients in the quickest way possible. So you can go from naught to 10,000 in your first month in the quickest way possible using a three-step system. All right, once you've done that 10,000, and I know maybe that sounds huge to you, I get that, but it's actually not that difficult based off a group coaching model. You can do it in a one-to-one -one model, but it's quicker to do it in a group coaching model. And so it really is only 20 people at 494, which is not a massive amount. You do the mass of that. Now, of course, you can charge more. All right, you could do it at 994, and that's less people, that's 10. But as soon as you do 10, 20 people at, at 994, you know, that's your first 20,000 month. All right, so we've got an exact step-by-step -step process of how to do that using a three-step process. It's called my clients and automation method. All right, and so 
how you duplicate it from the 10K months to the 100K year is actually following that same process. So we actually automate that month, that first initial month, we do a whole like live process and then we switch to automation. If you want the exact naught to 10K in the first month or naught to 100K in the first year, if you want the exact plan, if you're already doing over 100K, then we've got the same process that we duplicate for the 100K per month. If you want the step-by-step process is exactly how to do it, click the link, book a call with my team and you'll get a one-to-one coaching session on exactly how to do that in your business. All right, it's a straight up consultation session. It is a true value of $500. We have had you know, amazing feedback from people that have jumped up on the calls and they have had a great experience. We actually got emailed in a couple of weeks ago of someone that booked a consultation session with another provider out there you probably know their name. They paid $800 for a consultation session. They weren't that happy with it, jumped on one of our calls with our team, were blown away, walked away with a really clear plan of exactly how to go from naught to 10,000 in that first month and naught to 100,000 duplication off the, the back of that. Turning the whole thing into an automated process. And so, you know, I have a program called the Clients and Automation Process. And on that session with my team, they'll take you through the Clients and Automation methodology and how you can use it exactly in your business right now because you're unique you're individual and unique you need someone that actually works out it with you specifically um so they are limited uh, they do go really quick uh, just a heads up on that and so all you need to do is click the link go through the booking page fill out the application so you're really clear on where you are right now to where you want to be and they'll give you a bespoke individual one-to-one session so that you're really clear on that at the end of that session if you potentially want to become a client They'll walk you through what that entails, but it's not a pushy sales call. It's a straight up consultation session and you'll leave that with a really clear plan of exactly how to go to naught to 10,000 in that first month, how to duplicate that up to hit your 100,000 a year and then duplicate that down, speed that that whole process up so you can do 100,000 per month. We've had a bunch of clients do that, so super excited. If that's what you want, click the link and book a call. It's completely free with my team and we'll make sure you get that. That being said, thank you for watching the video, subscribe to the channel, and I look forward to seeing you soon.